Oh, hi. It's Rob again. And yeah, I'm up on the back porch again. You know what that means? Well, it just means I'm on the back porch. Uh, this week's video is uh, very quickly made. Um, turns out that uh, last night, which would be Thursday night, um, I had an electrical short. And so today I had to fix it. But I was able to find it and fix it, and it was surprising. So I figured I would try and show you guys. So, strap in, or something. Hi, it's Rob, and uh, I'm up on the ladder again because I have to fix something. Something went boomy zap in this light fixture last night. Uh, not sure what it is, but it seems to be some kind of a short. So, uh, it, you know, blew the breaker. And then, of course, when I tried to turn the breaker back on, there was spark, and uh, luckily, uh, Trisha was out here and noticed where the big spark came from out here. So I know that it's located in this light fixture. Uh, Alright, so we're going to go from here. I'm going to try and get some video so that you can kind of see what it is that I'm doing. I hope. <sighs> Wish me luck. I always like being on ladders so much. Hmm. Alright, first thing I'm just going to try and take the cover off. And of course, it's regular old flathead screws. I don't know why they still make those. They're just ugly. Oh, hush. And of course, I have the dogs outside that want to help. But they're down in the ground. They don't climb ladders very well, which is probably a good thing. All right. So I'm looking in here, and I am not seeing anything obvious that would be an issue. The ground is connected in there. There are no stray wires floating around. Um, hmm. I guess I'm going to have to look further into this and find out more of what's going on. I think I'm going to go down and try and turn the breaker back on and see if it still blows. Because that's always a good idea how to troubleshoot things. Alright, just as uh, easily you can tell which one is the one. And yes indeed, there is still a short. It's uh, certainly not the safest of ways of having a meter installed, but uh, Got it set up there. Okay, the power is off. I mean, you, you saw the breaker go. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a resistance check across these wires. Now, this is the first outlet or the first box that it, the wire comes into from uh, from the switch. And this is where everything, all the other light fixtures. There's only one other light fixture that ties into this, but it's a pain in the butt to get to. And so. I'm going to do a resistance check. And yes, indeed, there is a short. All right. Well, that's good. Because now we've just verified what seems to be going on. <sighs> so now what I'm going to do is pull these wires off and check and see where the short is living see if it's in this fixture or if it's in the other one. I have a feeling it's in the other one, which is going to be a pain in the butt, but uh, I guess we'll just go from there, right? Yep. No, it's not going to work very well, is it? Uh, can tighten this up. Right, I'll just see if I can hold it. Oh. 
in case you didn't realize, this is tough. Got a very precarious little tripod thingy here. Yeah, okay, that'll work. Alright, I might not be able to show you guys this, so just trust me. Alright, I found where the short was. I want to pop this in and see if it still breaks. It does not. So, that's just the light sensor switch going off. Uh, shut that off again. Uh, now I need to... Hmm. Alright, we're going to turn that on. Leave it on for now. Okay, now for more fun. This white wire is the one that is shorted out. I believe that this goes to the other fixture that's over there. And I want to test that because this is a live circuit right now. Uh-uh. So I want to slip that in there. <laughs> no! That in there, and then all right, test this one just to make sure. Yeah, there's nothing on that one, so it's all in there. I do believe. I can't get into it. Oh, yeah, there we go. 122 volts. Okay. Great. Uh, I'm going to have to get at that other fixture, and that is going to be a pain. All right, I'm going to have to figure out how to get all that done, so it'll be, uh, I'll be back in a minute. Okay, I've reconnected this and uh, set it back up so that it's fully wired in again. Now I'm going to try and move over to that other other uh, box with the lights. Uh. Alright, that is the fixture I need to get to. And uh, the reason it's a pain in the ass is because it's right where these stairs are. And to put a ladder in there would mean having to pull out these stairs, which I need to do anyway, but that's a uh, much bigger job than I want to do tonight. I think what I might do is try and move this stuff out of the way and see if I can run it. Oh, that's close. Wow. Wish me luck. So, that's up there. <sighs> I hate ladders. Well, the first good thing is that's a... Uh, it does have a square head. I don't know if I have a square head up here with me, but uh, it's a little more accessible than the other one. Uh, but, you know, I don't have enough hands. So, you know the drill. Sorry, it's the best view you get. And it's not a very stable one. Do I have any square heads? Twos, threes, and sixes. That's good. Come on. Uh, that works well. I'm going to have to show you what that is. Uh, okay. A 
So again, here there's nothing obvious. <coughs> Piper, Isis, stop it. Uh, not seeing any misconnections. Doesn't appear to be anything, but all right. I guess we'll do the testing. I'm uh, using this the grid cloth up here to hold everything. It actually works really well. All right, what I've done here is now I've got these two. So I've got this light fixture completely removed. I'm going to test these two, test the resistance across them, see if they're still short. I'm guessing not. I'm guessing that it's in here and this is probably not effective and needs to be replaced. But let's find out. And I'm trying to do this a little bit hands-free, so bear with me. Oh, come on. No. No. It's in the wiring. What the hell happened? <laughs> Isis, no. Try this again. Sure enough. That's crazy. Um, I don't know if you can see that, but this is a dead short across these two wires. Uh, okay, I'm going to have to look into that further. That is not a good, uh, not a good outcome. Isis? No. That one's a square. <laughs> so many different kinds of screws. I'll push you back. Okay. Have I mentioned I don't like being on ladders? So I've cut a piece of replacement wire. I'm going to just replace that section of wire and uh, try it after that. Okay, I'm just doing the clamping down while I'm out here because that will make it a whole lot easier to get back in. Let's 
Strain relief engaged. Well, you used to fit. Piper, no. Piper. Piper. No. Uh-uh. Piper. Piper. Right, come on. Piper, come on. No, come on. Come on. Oh, okay. So that's how it goes. All right. If you're gonna be like that, you're gonna be like that. Difficult place in which to work. Where are you, you screw? Nuts. I'm going to try and find a 1032 replacement screw. That does not make me happy.
Okay, I'm gonna start taking this one apart again. Spent a lot more time on ladders than I'd like to. Again, sorry about the angle. I think I see where the problem is. Notice the faint discoloration there. Uh, I guess you can probably see that. Yes, indeed. See where it just rubbed right through and shorted those two together. And boy, did she spark! Lovely. Well, it's good to find. Now let's put it back together. So it is working again. We are back live with electricity and stuff. I'm still going to have to deal with the uh, little curl of wire all up in here, but I can do that later. Right now I am going to put everything away, feed the dogs, and take it easy.